In this lesson, we're going to look at how we can integrate sine of 2x. And with this method, what we're going to use is a substitution. So I'm going to say, let u equal 2x. And what I do next is I differentiate this. So I would get du by dx is equal to 2. And I can rearrange this to find what dx is. Well, by rearranging this, we get dx is equal to du over 2. And now what we can do, we can substitute these back into the original integral. So the integral of sine of 2x with respect to x is equal to the integral of sine. Now instead of 2x, we know that 2x is now equal to u, so we get the sine of u. And dx, well, dx is equal to du over 2. So du over 2. Now this 2 here is actually a half. So we can bring that half outside the integral, just to simplify things a little bit. We get a half, and we've got the integral of sine of u with respect to u. Now the next step is to perform the integral. So what we've got is the half. Now the integral of sine of u is negative cosine of u plus the constant of integration. Now the next step, let's expand this bracket here. I'll do it over here. So we've got equals. We've got this one and this negative. So we've got negative cosine of u, and that's over two plus the constant of integration. And the last thing we need to do is to substitute back in for u. Well, we know that u is 2x. So we've got negative cosine of 2x, and that's all over 2, plus the constant of integration. Now, hopefully you found this video useful and you can subscribe and do the thumbs up, etc. But in the description, I'll put a link to a document that's got every integral from sine of 2x through to 25x and the cosine of 2x through to 25x. And that is a good reference manual to have. That's available on my website, link in the description. If you found this video useful, then remember to give me a quick thumbs up. And if you would like to be notified when I release new videos, then hit that subscribe button and remember to click on the little notification bell.